puts it in space. Stephen's the only one who can apply some pressure. Zach Tui got back and always had that one covered. Here's Burn. The Irishman all in. John's got to look at it. He's going to pick the pocket here of Rowe. He'll pick it up and run into goal. And Lin John well played. Yeah, horrible feeling when you kick across the defence. And that's just great from Lin Jong. He never gave up on it. He pressed down, just got there and forced the uh, spoil. Gets himself a nice, easy goal. Well done. Terrific forward pressure. Always fraught with danger, the switch across the face of goals. Well, this is the biggest lead of the match, and that will get you a game, I think, in this side every week, Richo. And uh, Lingy, if you can put pressure on Brendan Bolton, he just, he's had enough. He's going to go for a walk and just call his jets for a while, Bristol. Not sure where he's going, Darce, with six and a half remaining here. Right ankle, so a chipping ball from Caleb Daniel tracks the boundary line. Tui charging after it, keeps it in. Keeps it in, I should say. Sends the ball back to Burn. Can square it. Got it to Rose! Oh, no! Lin Jong! 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 Another Bulldog goal. And he kicks his first 12, 6, 78, 4, 3, 27, 21 and a bit gone. Third term, Beaumont Tiles scoreboard. Oh, well, uh, really poor switch there. He just needed to punch that ball a little bit harder, and they were out on the far side, the Blues. Some of the halfback flankers have worked hard for the next kick, not thinking in their wildest dreams that Ling Jong could or would get to that. Yes. But he came flying in. He timed it to perfection, got a fist across, brought the ball to ground, and uh, all his job was just to pick it up cleanly and run into an open goal. That's an outstanding bit of teasing distance there. He almost forced the Carlton player to do that because he backed his leg speed in. And the Triple M Chemist Warehouse replay screen shows Brendan Bolton going absolutely bunta in the Carlton <laughs> coach's box. Hamilton Daniel, he runs through defensive 50, kicks towards the wing, a vacant wing position. Ball close to the line, getting back first will be Tui. He's able to keep it in. Then he kicks back 30 metres inside defensive 50. Mark taken by Byrne. Oh, kick across the ground to row. Jong anticipated, fist it away, picked up goal. Brilliant stuff from Lin Jong. Quick thinkers there. Unbelievable stuff. And on the Chemist Warehouse scoreboard, the Dogs are further in front. Their biggest lead of the match, 12-6-78. Carlton 4-3-27. Margin out to 51 points. We played 21 minutes, third term on the Ray White Court. He's made a couple of bad blues, the young Irishman, but I don't mind the fact that he's trying to switch the play. He's trying to get it across the other side of the ground where, you know, a lot of the times tonight, Carlton have just blasted it back. But sharp thinking by Lin Jong. They've got so many players, as we spoke about in the first half, that are switched on. Their brains are switched on for not only skill level, but winning the ball, moving the quick. ball on quickly. And they are very quick. So the Bulldogs are going to improve to 3-1. and one.